Hey guys, it's iTag over the weekend. I got a post from Revan Pi uh, that just explains that the iOS 5 untethered jailbreak will uh, be released uh, most likely short after the final of iOS 5 is released, which is uh, Wednesday. And if you guys didn't know, the iPhone 4S is also going to be released Friday. Uh, if most likely you guys probably knew that, but yes, that'll be the iPhone 4S will be Friday. Uh, the new white iPod Touch and uh, iOS 5 final are both going to be released Wednesday. Uh, anyway, so uh, Ionic actually tweeted, he said, as far as I know, iOS 5 and Tether is covered by other people already. And he's referring to the Chronic Dev team, uh, Post, X, Post 6 Ninja, uh, however you pronounce that, I'm not exactly sure if I pronounced that correctly, uh, also known as Joshua Hill. And they're referring back to my Fest when he announced that they found five user land exploits. Uh, and the difference between user land and hardware is a hardware exploit will allow, uh, I think, it... It's any form of app releases to that device, I believe, can be jailbroken at, at least as a tethered jailbreak. I believe it's how a hardware exploit works. The user's land exploits uh, work uh, only for a specific uh, number of software, so it might work for only one software, two software, something like that. But anyway, uh, an example of a user land exploit would be uh, like uh, jailbreak me. I think they had that somewhere in here. Yeah, right here they got jailbreak me. Uh, and a hardware exploit would be like the Limerite exploit that most of the like the uh, the Red Snow like if you use Red Snow right now, uh, what jailbreaks like the betas of iOS five right now, what jailbreaks those I believe is the Limerite exploit the Lime Rain exploit I believe that's what's doing it I'm not positive on that but I think so, uh, and that's a hardware exploit so if you can do that as a tether jailbreak uh, on any software I believe that's made for that device uh, so I just want to cover this really quickly I'm not gonna go through the rest of the post I just want to say that. Uh, there will be an iOS 5 untethered jailbreak soon after the release, uh, most likely at, soon after the release. Uh, but that's it, guys. If you want to check out this post, I'll, if I remember, I'll put the link of it uh, in the description. But that's all for this video, guys. If you'd like to, go ahead and like it down below and uh, subscribe at the top to be notified when I release a new video in your YouTube homepage. This is iTech of the Week, guys. I hope you enjoyed the rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video.